It all started with a handshake between two veterans. Now the Partners for Peace Exchange program at Camp Ripley has been in place for 43 consecutive years. It's become a tradition, inviting over 150 members of the Norwegian Home Guard to participate in the troop exchange. And our Chelsea Brown talked with some of European soldiers about their experiences on U.S. soil. It's a great opportunity for us to see how the Americans operate, how the drills are carried out. A simulated combat maneuver training was performed as soldiers from the Danish and Norwegian Home Guards worked alongside soldiers at Camp Ripley. For about two weeks, the European soldiers experienced a military lifestyle and are introduced to cooperative training experiences with the American military. I like uh, these kind of ranges where uh, you have pop-up tar targets and uh, you get to uh, walk and shoot at the same time. So it's a bit more realistic than just standing on a shooting range. Beginning in 1974, the Partners for Peace program is the longest observed relationship exchange between two allied countries in the Department of Defense. It's a great visceral experience for us to uh, spend time with each other, especially with so much of their heritage embedded in Minnesota. Uh, that we're also very proud of, but then we can also sharpen our skill set, uh, be ready to fight, ready to move, and um, have fun while we're doing it. Alongside the training, the cultural aspect is a large part of this exchange, and today many of the youth were introduced to America's favorite pastime, the sport of baseball. We have similar games like sports in Norway, but not, not like this. And I think it's really cool to play with people from America and their sport, and like see their enthusiasm in it and kind of you see how it's the first time we play the sport and everybody wants to win and really excited to play it. The benefits of this program are reflected in the mutual techniques learned and observed as well as the friendships made during the exchange. They have a lot of fun and they have a great sense of humor and I still talk to a lot of the guys that were here last year. I just uh, like being social, uh, bonding with our, uh, our instructors from America and just yeah, having a good time. It's always great to be here. Uh, as I said, it's the second time and I have, haven't been disappointed this time. Not at all. At Camp Ripley, Chelsea Brown, Lakeland News. The European troops plan to stay until the 29th of June with plenty of activities on their plate, including their training. Tonight they enjoyed a homemade Norwegian dinner and they plan to attend the Lakes Jam concert in Brainerd for a little fun this weekend. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.